Uh, today I'm changing a uh, circulating hot water pump that goes on the heating system. Um, if you're changing one of these, the first thing you want to do is you want to cut the power off to the unit. Um, the, this one, as you can see, started arcing real, real bad in this area. That means that they're having problems with it turning. Um, cut the power off first and then commence to taking it apart. It has uh, four bolts and nuts, two on the bottom, two on the top. You remove that, uh, remove the electrical. You can see it's really arcing bad right here. Um, you're gonna separate the black and white wires. Very important that you do cut the power off so the unit won't come in. And also relieve the pressure on a heating unit, which would be right here. Make sure there's no pressure on it when you Taking that off so it won't uh, get burnt by any scalding water. Um, we're going to get started on this. Uh, I have the new one right here. You have two uh, rubber gaskets that fit. One fits in a ring right here in this area. And then you have one on the other side. Pay attention to where, to which way the arrow is going on the pump. This one the arrow is going straight down. It always will tell you which way is the water is supposed to go. So please pay attention to that. That's the new one. Here are the rings that I was just talking about that fits in that area for the gasket. This, this is actually the gasket ring. Um, as you can see on the old, the old pump that's still on the unit, the arrow is pointing down. Um, also, when you're changing this, you want to close as many valves as you can. Just remember which ones you close. These are the ones that you close right here. And you also close these two right here. We have two zones. That's why you see two of everything. Uh, these are the zone valves up here. But you close those so you keep the water in the system. Because once you uh, remove the pump, uh, some water is going to come out. Most of it's going to come out of the boiler. So please try to let it cool down first before you do that. So you won't get burnt. And um, just proceed with, with uh, cautions. Um, I've let the system cool down. And I've turned the power off. So I'm going to proceed to taking the circulating hot water pump off. And I'll get back to you and let you see how it looks when it's complete. Um, I've turned all the valves back on. And as you can see... This is the new unit. I made sure I turned all the valves, open all the valves back up. And this is what the product looks like when you're done. All new. It was the unit that was bad, that was burnt out. And that's what it is. Just gotta make sure you tighten up these bolts tightly. Get a nice seal on it. And we're back off to having some heat upstairs now. And that's how you put on a circulating pump on a hot water system.